Hey, what's up, you guys? My name is Swati, and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Where if the book is nice, we read it twice. Today, I'm bringing you another TBR. So I took a break from making a TBRs last month, but today I'm back on the game, and I have prompts picked from 52 book club reading challenges as well as Pop Sugar Reading Challenge 2023. So let's begin. The first prompt is a book where main character's name is in the title and for which I have selected Agatha Christie's Marple, a brand new collection of short stories featuring the Queen of Mysteries, legendary detective Jane Marple, penned by 12 remarkable best-selling and acclaimed author. The next prompt is a book with love triangle. And for that I have picked School of Good and Evil. Sophie and Agatha are all about to discover that the legend of School of Good and Evil is true. Where two children go, one good, one and beautiful, and second odd and outcast, who train to become fairy tale heroes and villains. The next prompt is a book that has been challenged or banned in any state in 2022, for which I have selected All Boys and Blue. LGBTQIA plus activist George M. Johnson explores his childhood and adolescence as a black queer boy. It is a series of personal essays. So the next prompt is a book that fulfills your favorite prompt from last year's. Now I have not done this challenge before, so I don't have any favorite prompt. So I have randomly picked up a font from last year that I like, which is a book set on a plane, a train, or a cruise. For which I have selected cruise, and and the book's name is Death on Nile by Agatha Christie. I am already reading a short stories collection from Agatha Christie this month, so why not? This book as well. This is Agatha Christie's most daring travel mystery. Poirot is on a holiday or on a, on a cruise along the Nile, which is interrupted by death of Lynette Ridgeway, who has been shot. The next prompt is a book becoming a TV series or movie in 2023, for which I have selected everybody's favorite, A Lesson in Chemistry. by boni garmas with very original and vibrant protagonist elizabeth zot we take a journey through her life from a chemist with all male team to a reluctant star of america's beloved cooking show supper at 6 it has been garnering amazing applause everybody loves this new heroine and i can't wait to get to know what it is all about the next prompt is set in australia for which i have selected apple never falls if your mother is missing will you tell it to police even if your father was the prime suspect that is the premise of this book these are grown up children we are talking about and i don't want to know more about it so i'll find out when i read this book the next prompt is featuring one of the seven deadly sin for which i have selected pride and there is no mistake about it i have selected the book pride and prejudice by jane austen this is a lovely nerdy in a edition i have recently acquired it and i absolutely love it it's beautiful and i can't wait to read this one this one is the most superb comedy of manners of regency england they call it the most popular novel in english language can't wait to read about elizabeth bennet and mr darcy the next prompt is by a caribbean author for which i have selected how the one armed sister sweeps her house this is set in barbados the novel is about four no people each desperate to escape the legacy of violence in a so called paradise this is outside my wheel house but i am glad that this prompt is pushing me to read things i would not have usually picked and i assume i will be entertained by this so the next prompt is set during wars other than world war 1 and world war 2 for which i have selected a book based also based in korean war there is a slight mention of world war 2 but after that 
this book encompasses multi generational story and therefore a korean war is also part of that story this is pachinko this is well known historical fiction starting with sonjay also falls when with sonjay who falls for a wealthy stranger who promises her the world but after getting her pregnant discloses that he is married to avoid shame for her family she marries is a minister and leaves for japan this results in a generational story now from korea to japan to pachinko so that's pachinko by min jin lee and it's a chunky one and i can't wait to get into it and the last prompt for the day is a typo book with a typographic cover for which i have selected ocean cleon series which is steel like an artist show your work keep going these are simplistic covers but only only covered with um, uh, typography but this these books packs a punch i have read them before and i want to read them again so that i can do a in depth analysis on my cha- on my channel so this is still like an artist these are quickly finishable books which talk about ideas of creation or creativity and how to be a creative in present time and how to keep on going these are all the books i want to get to this month please comment down below and let me know any books that you are interested in reading this month and i will see you soon with another video soon please like and subscribe if you like what i do over here bye bye